NFL prize picks for Super Bowl 58. If you don't know who's playing, you must be living under a rock. But I'll tell you anyway. It's 49ers and Chiefs. I'm Sniper from DFS Army. Hit the like button. I'm going to give you six plays for Super Sunday. Listen, they're all not the best value plays, but we're going to dig into the Proptimizer. They're what I think are the best available. you got to have a full ticket for Super Sunday. We're going to do our best to cash a six for six. Let's do the intro. Let's go to work and get these six plays to you. All right, here it is. It's the DFS Army Prop Optimizer. If you don't know, it compares prize pick lines, sports book odds, and projections to help you find the best plays. A lot of places have odds-based tools. Great, cool. They would tell you to play Juwan Jennings, but our projection model, it's got him over, so that's a pass. Is the difference in our tool. Links down below to check it out, along with deposit matches. Same thing with Travis Kelsey. That's a pass, too. What is the number one play on the board? Yeah, you get. you would not have guessed it. Kyle Juszczyk, more than three and a half receiving yards. It's lined at minus 140 on DraftKings, great value, minus 135 on BetMGM, and four and a half yards is the pick him over on FanDuel. It's been over four the last five games. you got this great last five, 10, 15 tool. If that's your thing, it's been over like it's 11 and four the last 15 games on our projection model. That's this last play right here. Has him at 11.47 yards. We think he's going to go over the odds would tend to agree. Let's jump to prize picks and let's do it. Well, you know what I should say? Honestly, play number one, actually, I haven't used the Patty Mahomes um, promo yet. So that's going to be my first play. If you've already used it, you can still run this as a five pick. The implied odds value on prize picks for a five and a six are the same. So that's what I'm going to go with. And then here's the Kyle use check play for more than three and a half receiving yards. Let's jump back over to the DFS Army Proptimizer, Patty Mahomes. It's a pass because our projection is too high. Debo Samuel, same thing. It's tight here, but again, beggars can't be the choosers. So I am going to go Brock Purdy more than one and a half touchdowns. It is lined at minus 135 at BetMGM, minus 130 at DraftKings, depending on the book. Still getting a little bit of value here. And it's been over. Um, let's extend it out a little bit. It's about 50-50 here. Look, you know, and you can go six of the last 10. You get a nice little sample size here if you really kind of cherry pick. I get it. But our projection model has them at 1.56. I think there's going to be some offense in this game. I don't think it's going to be a defensive stalemate. I think you would think... The Chiefs are going to be focused on shutting down Christian McCaffrey. I will roll with Brock Purdy here and a more than one and a half touchdown prop as my play number three. Brock Purdy. More than one and a half tutties. That is play number three. Back on over. Play number four. Christian McCaffrey. More than four and a half receptions. Lined at minus 130 on DraftKings. I like the odds value there. It's been over three of the last five games and six of the last 10. Could peak here. A little closer to 50-50 the last 15, but coming on in the playoffs, it looks like. Projection model, 5.01 receptions. All those things together, that is going to be a solid play in my book. So this will be play number four. And you can see how easy the DFS Army tool makes it to find these plays. Odds, projections. Should have changed the, the tab I was sharing while I was talking. Sorry about that, guys. Now we're up here. You see I've selected the Christian McCaffrey play. That's play number four. Well, I'm talking about how good the tool is, which it is. Play number five. We're going to go to the other side. We're talking receiver checkdowns. That's what kind of ticket we are building. Isaiah Pacheco, more than three receptions. Lined at the three and a half. Now, okay. My, over two and a half is minus 172. Caesars has got this at uh, three and a half plus 110. Really, every, everybody in Vegas is projecting this to be at three receptions. Projection model, though, bumps it over 3.53. He's been over, well, he's been over flat three of the last five games. This is a little deceiving because you got a push in here. The last 10, it looks like four, four, four wins, four losses. Two pushes. These red bars here are pushes. So kind of the 50-50 prop 
with how I think this game is going to play out. I do like this in terms of the um, the ticket I am building. So we're going to roll with Isaiah Pacheco here more than three receptions. I don't mind having a push prop in here. When they start getting two or three, yeah, I get a little bit dicey. We'll see how uh, play number six ends up again when you're down here. And I'm already in the orange plays. Typically, I wouldn't go this far down. But like I said in the open, it's Super Bowl Sunday. You have to run a six man. I think. I think you just have to. And now this is where things get interesting. I can either go Travis Kelsey at less than seven receptions or Noah Gray more than one and a half receptions. I'm going to go just go straight with the prop optimizer here. My daughter, who's seven, is going to hate this pick, but it is what it is. Travis Kelsey, less than seven receptions. Six and a half is mine at minus 130 at Caesars, minus 140, minus 145 at other books. I can see why they bumped it. Typically, I like to say, why did they bump this? I get it. Once you get over 145 at places, you kind of have to bump it to seven. But I'll take the push on seven. He's been under three of the last five games, including a push. But under seven of the last ten games with two pushes in there. Only one loss. Just this last time out was, was the loss in the last 15. Goes down a little bit. Projection model, like I said, thing I'm really leaning on here, 6.46 receptions. Go ahead, Kelsey. Pop off for six catches and three touchdowns. Just don't get number seven, and we're cool. And that will be play number six. We'll jump on over. Oop, if I could spell Travis right. They should have put him in here as Travis Swift, but what do I know? Those are the six plays. We covered six Super Bowl Sunday plays in about seven minutes. Hit the like button. See you in the DFS Army. You got to get access to that tool as we're rolling through NBA season. Here's the recap. Patty Mahomes promo. Cop out. More than 0.5 passing yards. Kyle Juszczyk. More than three and a half receiving yards. Brock Purdy. More than one and a half passing touchdowns. Christian McCaffrey. More than four and a half receptions. Isaiah Pacheco. More than three receptions. And Travis Kelsey. Less then seven receptions, 25 bucks to win 625. We're going to lock that in. That's our play here on YouTube for DFS Army. Plenty more in the Discord. Make sure you check that out as part of the package down below. And here's the daily reminder that whether or not you are a DFS Army member, you probably should be. But either way, good luck in those contests. Hit the like button, and I'll see you next time.